Sarah Mukabana, weighing 120 kg, is an activist for the plus size women. Mukabana says that she struggled for a period of two years with different instructions on nutrition and treatment to reduce her weight. And during that time, Mukabana has faced many cases of humiliation, ridiculed in many occasions to the point that she felt her reputation was diminished in the society. My platform and passion is like getting people to feel confident. So I'm a confidence champion. Every time I walk on the street, somebody is mentioning something about how I look, my body weight, my size. Hey, size your mind. Hey, manje. Hey, momo. <laughs> I can't deal. Mukabana is currently being followed by more than one million people on her social media pages. On her page, she posts pictures and videos of her body and positive messages about being plus size, having embraced her body. <laughs> One of the stereotypes I really hate, especially about like bigger people, is that we're lazy and we don't want to like do the work necessary in order to get fit or slimmer or whatever. As some of the challenges facing Mkabana also face slender people in the society. Time in the Africa, I talk on beer when in Konda, Kikula, Kikona, any time on a Kula, on a Kabia, on a Kula, Hunoni, but me, Nashkuru. Dr. Pranval Pancholi from Alvin Clinic in Nairobi, who has launched the Aluron Balloon that reduces the amount of food intake in the body, says that many people do not pay attention to good nutrition. He, however, recommends the need for every person to practice and visit health facilities to know their health status. Probably try diet. You failed in a few diets. You've tried gym. Yeah? And there may be metabolic reasons. It could be after pregnancy. It could be hormonal. It could be psychological. Sometimes antidepressants make people put on weight. Yeah? So there's a myriad of reasons why diet and exercise may not have worked. And while there is continued mixed feelings of people being body shamed, calls are being made to the society at large to accept how others have accepted themselves in a bid to fight stigma. With increased cases of body shaming across the country driving many into the chains of depression, there is a call to the society to create a conducive environment that will see everyone feeling safe regardless of their body types. Faith Anula, K24, Nairobi County.